And okay, so let's let's uh, let's talk about you. What you you are? Uh, which which school did you go to in in, in uh, primary school? Okay, I went to my primary school was we use, okay okay talk about me. All right, let me show you my photograph. Wait, 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 uh, wait, 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 wait okay. so this was me and mom. It's frozen. Oh, 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 baby photo. Okay. 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 This is a big, bigger one. Okay, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I can. I think I can see. Two <laughs> pictures. And good. then I'll show you something. I'll show you something else. Okay. So then this was all growing up, lah. Growing up years. This one was in uh Tiam Lai Ku's house. Right. But, but he lives in Kampa Road. Then I can still remember. Okay, then, okay, so then growing up years, you know, I don't know who went to, who went somewhere, like, this is the Penang Airport, like, it's my brother and myself. Oh. I, I got one last one afterwards to show you, anyway, these were the times when we all have to do like that. Yes, go to the Very formal as a young kid, got to take photographs like that. Yeah, yeah. And this That's is the best cute. one that connects me to... Your grandma's house at Lim Yang Teng Road. We were ah, swimming like a monkey. Yes, that is definitely yes, at yes. that time, oh, we always yes. have a... Remember your Lim Yang Teng Road house? Yes, that is definitely the house. That is definitely the house. Lim yes. Yang Teng Road? Yes. No more of this. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, I said I got this photo. So spend a lot of your, our time in your place too. <laughs> in your grandma's place too. <laughs> oh, okay. You have you scanned the yeah. photo? So I I grew up. So I grew up in Beach Street. Uh, I can scan those photographs. Yeah, that's this me and my brother's monkey monkey time. So. <laughs> oh, that's your 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 brother. Okay, okay. Because I'm trying to recognize uh, which of my uncles that 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 is. Yeah, that's me and my brother. <laughs> you, you know that you can uh, scan photo using the <laughs> there, there is a uh from Google. Yeah. There is a yeah, there is yeah. app called Photo Scan. And you just hold your phone over. It doesn't matter oh, whether you're using it. Your, the, the Google yeah. will know yeah. how to make it uh, uh, fit again. It, it, it will know. Okay. Yeah. You, you just okay. uh, it, It's really, really simple. It will, it will tell you how to use it. Really simple to use. And you just have to, to, to scan it. Yeah. You, uh, um, I, 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 well, one day, I took uh, my kit. Uh, so, we, we, I scanned lots of my mom's old photos and, and whatnot. You know, just to tell them that your grandma didn't always used to look like this old lady. You know, she used to be quite hot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's true. It's true. Yeah. So, so yeah, please, please scan it and then keep it somewhere. Uh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. Which, 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 uh, which school did you attend? Okay. When I was in, in kindergarten, I was in this one called Hu Yu Xia which is in, I can't remember what road it is anymore. It's like a Chinese association kind of kindergarten. So I went to that one. And then when I, in my primary school, I was in Island Girls School. It is still there. Uh, yeah, Island Girls School. And then when I was in, then I was in Polo Ground Secondary School for my lower secondary. And then I went to Tungku Puan Hapsa. And then after that, uh, oh, then I finished from five, and then I just did my college. My uh, I work. I I work. I study in Sima College, like the Stanford College. And then after that, I started working. So I started working quite young when I was about probably about nineteen. Ooh. Yeah. What What did you yeah. do? So I do secretary. I did uh, in my college. I did my uh, secretarial uh, diploma. So I started off with a clerical job in a testing laboratory, typing all the testing reports and learning, oh my God, ice cream has got so much bacteria parts per million. <laughs> you know, that's where you learn all these things. <laughs> oh, okay. And then, yeah, then after that, I worked with a law lawyer's company, a law company. Um, and, that's where, and that's where I learned that uh, uh, you can also do, so we, we have to do a lot of uh, law reporting so the lawyers was really good he trained us a lot in a lot of things and he said oh do you want to do law external I said how many years does it take 10 years no 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 so right. I didn't pursue on that one yeah but then I I picked up some uh, because secretary course we do uh, shorthand so then I went to pick up she says okay you go and do some courses in Bahasa Malaysia 
you know, like uh, shorthand in Bahasa Malaysia. So we did that in like, uh, I think there's another, not, not the pigment studies, there's another one I can't remember. But anyway, those were the days. And then after that, I worked for a few years. Then I worked for uh, the Golden Sands Hotel. Exciting times growing up. Yeah. So then I worked for the Golden Sands for about a couple of years. And then I worked for the Lang uh, and then I went over to Langkawi and worked with the Pelangi Beach Resort. We opened up the hotel with the general manager. That was like really exciting time. Yeah. So then I worked there for about two years. And then I came back, I came into Australia. Then I worked with uh, I came, my first port of call in Australia is Melbourne. So I worked temping for a while. And then after that, we came into Brisbane, where I now live probably will be forever. <laughs> yeah. And then I worked with the Sheraton. I continue working in the hotels. I worked at the Sheraton uh, Brisbane for a couple of years. And then I went home to Malaysia for two years because my mom wasn't well. Ah. So then came back here for two years. And then Rachel was born. My firstborn was born. And then after that, when she was one, we came back into Brisbane. So okay. then came back to Brisbane. I did a couple of temping jobs. And then I worked for, because I think when we have a child, you want to do work-life balance. So yeah. I worked with the government. So yeah, so I've worked with the government. Queens oh. and Health for many years, for about 25 years now. So wow. probably next year, I'll be hanging out my boots. Yeah, because I worked 20, 40 years of my 60 years life. <laughs> So, so, so not, next year I'll be six. Not retired yet. No, no. So probably next year I should. What What is the retirement age? There's no retirement age. You can still go on actually. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Okay. 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 It, yeah, it, uh, yeah. Malaysia used to be fifty five, but now they've pushed yeah. it to sixty. And then uh, yeah. they're complaining that there are not enough jobs for the young graduate. Yeah lah. You You make people work longer. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no job yeah. <laughs> but here, everybody keeps working. I mean, like, that's why it took me a long time to, to see whether I should retire. But, you know, it's like, well, you've worked 40 years of your 60 years life and I'm always working sitting now. And I think it's time to do something different, you know, to, to not sit anymore because sitting is really bad for you. Oh. So, yeah, so all my work is always management admin so it's always sit down sit down sit down you know i think yeah. it's about time yeah and also working 40 years you know giving 40 years for me it's like coming in here i think i should give to the community so you know it's like working it's really good so giving back to the community and i think i've done my share <laughs> you know many years 25 years working for prison health i think that's that's good good enough years so i should yeah. go and do something else lah, pursue something else yeah, yeah. so probably next year retire from this job oh, okay 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 that, well, uh, uh, that's good to hear that you got some sort of plan you know instead of saying oh, no, I'm, not, I'm just going to vegetate <laughs> no, I, I don't know I hesitated for a few times you know one thing to retire yeah so anyway so I've got two kids so Rachel was born in Penang we brought her back here in uh, when she was one sure. and then uh, yeah and then three years later then Marcus was born so the two are now like you know 28 and 24 now. Seriously? Yeah. I, Rachel, you know, met them. Yeah. The, I, I remember them sending me a photo of uh, a, a Sea World thing where they took a photo with this huge walrus thing and I was kidding Marcus about being too fat and, and uh, uh, mistaken, mistakening the, the, the walrus for him. And, and then that, that <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I remember I remember that, that, that photo. Uh, um, yeah, I was kidding him about, about being the, the, the walrus. But uh, yeah, oh my God, it's not good. Yeah, yeah. Time flies. That's long ago. Hmm. Yeah, they remember that you, you were doing magic tricks for them. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now they're 28 and 24. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, okay, 